Well, just a few minutes ago, uh, Fox News announced that Tucker Carlson was no longer a host at Fox News. Wow. I mean, what a, what a, what a turnaround. I mean, he was, uh, Tucker Carlson, the most watched TV personality, uh, the most watched TV personality on TV. Um, and it really looks like he was fired by Fox. Uh, it's it's hard to believe that he just left voluntarily. It, it it's uh, it it really does seem, um, it really does seem that Fox uh, has done the, is, has fired him. This is the announcement. The announcement is Fox News Media and Tucker Carlson have agreed to part ways. And and listen to this. Talk about a cold send off. We thank him for his service to the network as a host, and prior to that as a contributor. God. Talk about cold. <laughs> I mean, this is fantastic news. Um, anything that diminishes uh, the importance and significance and role and prominence of Tucker Carlson is spectacular. I, I think it makes uh, it makes news better. It makes information better, uh, and and it it. Um, Primarily by by uh, reducing the distraction and reducing the lies, the disinformation, the nonsense, and and the stuff that one has to correct and fix, uh, you know, in the in the kind of shallow interpretation of Tucker Carlson that, that was pitched as conservatism or as Americanism. Um, so uh, yeah, good riddance. I I for one, happy to see him. No, now now in the chat, people are saying Don Lemon is gone as well. Um, which is interesting. I have no idea what the background is for that, why he's gone, and so on. I've never seen Don Lemon, maybe once or twice. Obviously, a, a, a kind of a, a leftist stooge, but um, never interacted with him. Never, never done anything. So, I, you know, Tucker Carlson for me much bigger, partially, uh, partially because uh, he was so influential and he was so, I think, a part of shifting. And helping shift and echo the shift uh, of the Republican Party and the and the and the the, the people uh, tilted to the right, uh, their shift towards populism, towards statism, towards a pro-Russia foreign policy, and a and a statist a domestic policy. This is a guy who celebrated um, uh, Elizabeth Warren's economic plan. And if you don't believe me, you can go watch that uh, Tucker Carlson show where he talks about. Elizabeth Warren's economic plan, I covered it at the time, and celebrates it because of all the central planning it involves. Um, and at the same time, um, uh, again, uh, uh, defended the worst elements on the right from uh, January 6th uh, to the worst uh, elements within, uh, within Trump to the biggest conspiracy theories, which ultimately is what I think got him fired, uh, were the conspiracy theory of uh, the sto so-called stolen election. And and uh, and the conspiracy theories revolving around uh, Russia, Ukraine, and all of that. So good riddance. I'm kind of happy. Um, uh, you know, I've been attacking him for a long time. I don't believe I had any role in getting rid of Tucker Carlson. I wish I had. It wouldn't that be cool? But I I probably didn't. But it is consistent with my view of the world that Tucker Carlson not be there. Now he'll find a place. He's got a massive audience. I don't forget that I predicted years ago that Tucker Carlson could very well be a presidential candidate and could very well be a, 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 a much, much more dangerous uh, Republican presidential candidate and, and, and maybe president one day. So that could be in his future, running for president. Uh, that would be interesting, uh, although it may be more difficult uh, now, uh, would have been easier if he was coming off of a high from Fox. Um, and he could land up in a daily Why I could land up in a, a bunch of different things. I don't think Tucker Carlson is going to be out in the streets. I don't think Tucker Carlson is going to be uh, struggling. Remember, uh, this ha I'm sure this has a lot to do with a settlement with uh, Dominion. I, you know, I, I doubt that as part of the settlement, Fox committed to firing Tucker Carlson, but it could be a number of things. One, Fox could have asked Tucker Carlson to make a formal apology uh, on air because it now has this other uh, $2.6 billion lawsuit from, uh, from this other company 
and, and, and maybe uh, getting Tucker Carlson to do an apology or something like that would make uh, settling that lawsuit easier. Maybe, uh, maybe it has to do with the fact that there was a lawsuit by a former producer of Tucker Carlson and Maria Bartolomo, and, um, and that she uh, had, has made some pretty, um, you know, I don't know if illegal, but pretty unsettling accusation against Tucker Carlson and the way uh, uh, Tucker Carlson and, and the way uh, that newsroom or, or that program was run and, and attitude towards women and other things. So, um, uh, so hard to tell. Um, you know, uh, hard to tell exactly what on behind the scenes. It'll be interesting to find out if we ever find out. But it's clear that this is related, I think, unequivocally, this is related to, to the whole uh, Dominion, to the whole, uh, uh, you know, election, um, uh, the idea of, of, a, of, a, of, of the elections being tampered with, uh, the Tucker Carlson, that idea that Tucker Carlson hell spread. There's no question in my mind that his leaving, his departure for Fox, has a lot to do with the fact that he promoted that, uh, that particular fallacy and uh, was responsible, partially responsible, for making it as popular as it became. Um, so, yeah, good riddance. Tucker Carlson's gone. He was the most watched host on cable news network. Average audience of 3.2 million viewers. That's a big deal, guys. Now, but think of it this way. Um, uh, however many billions of dollars of profit Tucker Carlson made Fox, partially because of him, they lost... They had us give away $780 million uh, uh, on the lawsuit. So, uh, uh, yeah, too late now, but I think, I think they're trying to cover up, um, uh, cover up uh, the mess. Thank you for listening or watching the Iran Brooks Show. If you'd like to support the show, we make it as easy as possible for you to trade with me. You get value from listening. You get value from watching. Show your appreciation. You can do that by going to yourownbookshow.com slash support, by going to Patreon, subscribe star, locals, and just making a appropriate contribution uh, on any one, of those, uh, any one of those channels. Also, if you'd like to see the Your Own Book Show grow, please consider sharing our content and, of course, subscribe press that little bell button right down there on YouTube so that you get an announcement when we go live. And for you, those of you who are ready subscribers and those of you who are ready supporters of the show, thank you. I very much appreciate it.